Welcome to this week's edition of DSS News. I'm Dominic. And I'm Kayong. Here's the news for Friday, November 4, 2022. For sports, there were a varsity volleyball championship last Friday and Saturday. The girls' team competed Dwight, while the boys were at YASS. There were cross-country championship on Saturday and at SFS, and soccer championship as well as KIS for boys and YASS for girls. This sports season is now over, so keep a watch out for the next season, which is swimming and basketball. Let's go to our athletes. When I started the race, I, I got a pretty bad start, so I wasn't feeling that confident. And beforehand, I was really nervous because I really wanted to finish in the top 20 to get the badge. And off the bat, I didn't get a good start. But throughout the race, I lapped a lot of, I overtook a lot of people. I was able to finish 16th, so I was really proud of myself. And I'm a bit sad that I couldn't get the first badge, but I'm happy to get the second. Do you think you've improved from the other races? Yeah, definitely. I think compared to the first race, my time got much better and personally I just feel um, much better now. Unfortunately, this week's Halloween events were cancelled as we mourn the tragic events that occurred in Itaewon on October 29th. Instead, this Tuesday, we visited PYP students after school in Baker Space. Young PYP students have the opportunity to regularly bake on Tuesday and Thursday with Mr. Paulo every week. Let's see what they make this week. The thing I enjoy most about Baker Space is the enthusiasm of the kids who take the class. There's nothing better for a teacher than to be teaching a class that the kids really love. And uh, that's what I like most. I started because, you know, I had done this for six years in China and I had so much fun there and cooking and baking. They're my spark, and I just wanted to pass it on to other kids. Last Wednesday, October 26th, house activities for Spark 2.0 were held out in a big field. Our, our students participated in chants, tug of war, and our house captains managed their houses. Thank you to everyone for participating, and thank you to our house captains for trying to keep things safe and fun for everyone. Let's take a look at some clips. Hi, 
right, so today was the Dwight pep rally. Pep rally, probably not how we know it in the States, but we made our own Dwight version where we had a big competition between the houses. We presented our varsity volleyball team, the varsity cross country team, and our middle school soccer team, they competed in some tug of war. We saw lots of good aerobics dances, lots of noise in the chant off. It was very exciting today and a good start of really building that community spirit, that house spirit. Uh, we saw our house captains compete against each other 